Welcome to Second Story Garage. I'm Ashley Dean, and I am here with two grasshoppers and a Wookiee, and we're making mouth noises, which is kind of more exciting than the actual music, yeah? It really? Yeah. Oh, nice. <laughs> 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 David, still got it. Her All right. Too. That was got beautiful. Okay, are you going to work that in the rock opera? Uh-huh, yeah. It's going gonna, it's gonna to be scripted. You know, there's going to be, like, a character with a hernia. And everything he tries to lift, you know, all of the cyber things that he tries to lift. Yeah. Right. His name's Atlas. <laughs> <laughs> so on top of I sang Molly Brown, which is their real name, uh, we're, we have a rock opera going, and we also have a traditional Hebrew band on the horizon, from oh, what geez. I've heard. Wow. Yeah, I mean, seven minutes and eleven is is really going to go places. I think you know it's going to yeah. catch on. You know, YouTube's really going to let us blow up. So. Excellent, excellent. Klezmer will never be the same. Yeah, and this is sort of how you come up with song names, isn't it? Just mm. this kind of stuff. Kind of, yeah. I mean, we we try to be serious about things, but then we realize that sucks, so we go the other way. Right, right. And what what did we have? What was the first song's title today? Uh, uh, All Mom, Mom Blues, Blues Band. Band. Yes. Where like where did that come from? Do you remember? I've just always really wanted to be in one. Mm. Um, I figure the. Uh, you know, you, you kind of draw the crowd that you are. Um, if you're if you're an old dad blues band, then it's just dads that want to come see you. But if you're an old mom blues band, that's that's right where I want to be. Milf crowd. Yeah. All right. Well, hopefully we milf? can. <laughs> <laughs> Johnny doesn't watch so okay, don't worry about it. And then we had slap and pickle as well. That mm-hmm. was a good one. Mm-hmm. And uh, yeah, and there's a bunch of good ones on your latest album. And the, what's the title of the latest album? Uh, Ishmael Asimov is the the latest one. Yeah. What? Unless no. you count the one that came oh, out. No. Like, <laughs> four <laughs> years after that. Sorry, yeah. Sorry. Uh, Mind over Moth. Mind over That Mothra. was it, and you yeah. had a good story. The way it was a, just a misunderstanding, right? Yeah. yeah. I. Is it work? I overheard somebody across the kitchen that I work in say, "Well, it's just mind over." Oh no, I said it, and I said it's over mind over matter, and somebody else was like, "Did you say mind over Mothra? What's your deal?" And I was like, "I didn't," but that is. Way better somehow. And that could be a rock opera. It could be, mm-hmm. yeah, it should be. Absolutely. I think we might have. But then I think if you pay attention to your lyrics, it's a little bit more serious than the uh, names would betray. We don't talk to each other about lyrics because we don't want to expose like our deep, like inner sad guy mm-hmm. to each other. So I would definitely think less of you. Yeah. That's and you. Yeah, I mean, most of our songs are about the internal so. sexual tension. Yeah. So yeah. really, like, Johnny <laughs> broke my heart, and there was a lot of good songs that came out of that. Yeah. I had to do it. <laughs> well, <laughs> well, they say now, all like, bands are sleeping together. Definitely. So. Yeah, we actually right. have a Huey, Louie, and Dewey bunk beds. Oh, nice. Yeah, that's pretty sweet. That's pretty sweet. <laughs> that, that was after the, just the plane. Yeah, after, yeah. after you know, the breakup, mm. which we try not to talk about mm, for right. obvious reasons. Yeah, that's harsh. But yeah, bunk beds. Cool. Well, uh, so people, if they want to pick up your music, other than in our videos, they can do that all online mostly, right? Yeah, it's all on Bandcamp, so icingmollybrown.bandcamp.com. It's all there. Excellent. Plug. Yeah, for a reasonable fee. Yeah. yeah. And if you don't have that, you can email us and we'll probably... There's no fee, it's just duty. Yeah. Like the gross so kind? Yeah, like, so <laughs> if you access the internet through an airport, then it's duty free there, but everywhere else. And it's, I don't think it's taxed in airports either. I think you can, yeah. like, get squirrely with, like, tax rates in between states. Or in international airports. Maybe in the air. In the air is probably the best place to buy our own. <laughs> Airplane Wi-Fi. All right. Well, take a flight and buy their music. And uh, one last thing, because we, we need a nice band photo, let's close this out with a lovely pose, shall we? Mm-hmm. All right, here we go.